What's up, Beard Army? Welcome back. Hope you're all doing well. You know, I get asked a lot why I never do those, like, giant DIY home kitchen style eating challenges. And the reason is threefold. First, my kitchen isn't big enough. Second, I don't have the culinary expertise to pull off something epic like healthy junk food or Nate Figueroa. Although, even he gets it wrong sometimes. I don't know why batter is so hard to make. And third, when it comes to cooking, I'm just kind of super lazy. But... I've recently taken up alchemy, believe it or not, and I think I might have finally nailed the little potion which can turn regular sized things into giant things. So, I'm going to whip it out here, put a few drops on this little uh, croissant, see what happens. Just stand back because this is potent stuff. A few little drops here. Okay. I will just wait a while. It worked! A giant croissant! Seems to be a slight defect in that, for some reason, it's now filled with cream and strawberries, but I like strawberries and cream, so that's a win. <laughs> Hope I can get the special effects right on this afterwards, otherwise, that's gonna look ridiculous. Look at the size of this thing. Of course, I haven't taken up alchemy as a hobby. I purchased this from an incredible bakery called Dumouchel. I hope I'm saying that right, which is in Garforth in uh, West Yorkshire, just on the outskirts of Leeds, which is about 15 miles from my house. So I just picked this up and this is way bigger than I expected it to be. I have no idea how much it weighs. They told me it's like four pounds, but this looks quite a lot bigger to me. We'll see. I'm not confident that I'm going to be able to finish this, but how delicious does this look? It looks incredible. It's like a giant croissant filled with Chantilly cream, strawberries, blueberries, some kind of jam or jus or something on top. And uh, of course, a little bit of powdered sugar. But man, I'm excited to eat this. I don't think I've ever been this excited before filming a video. So without further ado, this is Big Mix Food and this is the biggest croissant in the universe. It has to be. There's never been a quest on this big before, I'm sure of it. <gasps> Alright, so... I don't know about this one. I'm gonna give myself an hour to do this, let's say. No idea how many calories are in it. I'll try and maybe guess if there's some way to do it. You know, estimate, but um, without further delay, let's get underway. I don't, how am I gonna... Alright, let's just... I'm gonna tear off a big piece. Ugh. God, there's no way this is four pounds. <laughs> yeah, you can say that again. What's up, Beard Army? Welcome back. I hope you're all enjoying your day. I hope you enjoy today's video, which is the world's biggest croissant. It has to be. I don't think I've ever seen a croissant this big. Just reaching for some water there, which I'm going to need lots of because this pastry is pretty flaky. This is going to mess it. It's starting to work. I brought this with me just in case. Uh, just... Oh, look at the size of that. <laughs> yeah, I think it goes without saying that this is one of the biggest things, certainly in terms of dimensions that I've ever eaten. And it, this almost actually wouldn't fit in the car on the way back from the uh, the bakery. And speaking of bakery, I've got to give a big shout out to Dumouchel. I'll put their uh, social media details and website below because they do some amazing stuff. So check them out if you're into baked goods. Who isn't into baked goods though? I don't even know if there's any point in me trying to clean my beard for this one. Ugh. Ah. 
actually got a really good croissant joke. And there aren't many. You should never trust a croissant. They're always super flaky. It's a fun sort of little, you know. That's terrible. <laughs> I don't know where I heard that joke. Yeah, if I don't tell a really cheesy joke, is it even a beard video? Who knows? Anyway, I'm not gonna bore you with commentary. This thing was delicious, and I'll catch you at the end. This is <laughs> this is easily the most ridiculous thing I've ever done. My beard's gonna have so much cream in it. By the end of this, I'm gonna look like Father Christmas. Or Captain Birdside because. Christmas is still three months away. <laughs> oh, come on. Four pounds, man. That thing right there probably weighs two pounds. I'm gonna have to do something about the mess. That looks a little bit better. Oh god. This is hard. Just like humongous slabs of pastry and cream. Um. It's doable though. I believe in myself. Mm. It doesn't help that obviously croissant, the pastry croissants are made out of, is really dry so it's hard to eat it fast. It's delicious but at the same time just brutal. Right, 20 minutes and I'm about halfway. Ugh. 20 minutes and I'm about halfway, I think. <laughs> you know when I ordered this, I went to pick it up from the bakery and they were like, what are you going to do with this? Is it for some kind of party or something? I was like, no, I'm going to eat it. And they started laughing, they're like, what? So they didn't believe me. So I really want to finish this so I can send it to them and show them that this uh, croissant, which is meant for like 40 people or something ridiculous, can actually be eaten by one person. At this point, I'm not so sure though. There's no way for me to not be messy though. Just so, in case people think I'm doing it on purpose. I'm not, it's just look at it, you know. I mean, <clears throat> there's no way to eat this clean. 
especially when you have bread. What was that sound? I'm wondering if I take a little break. Like a two minute breather is going to help. <coughs> uh, uh, screw you. This video is either going to be a big hit or like 50% of people will instantly unsubscribe when they see the way my beard looks. Oh, come on, it's just doable. Totally doable. Oh, see if I can do it like two halves of a sandwich. Come on. Come on, man. The cream is making it very difficult now. It's making me feel very sick. I mean, I love cream, but there's probably like 6,000 calories of cream. Just, just cream in this. Doable, come on. Just a big creamy slab. This is probably almost as grueling to watch as it is to eat the first like 20 bites of this was so delicious I don't want to eat anymore the thought of all of that cream all of this cream in my mouth is just going to make me heave Oh, difficult video I've done for a long time. I know there's a lot of debris, cream, fruit, whatever. But if I eat any more cream, I'm probably just gonna throw up everywhere. And this is the last bite of the actual croissant, so can I call it a sneaky victory this week? Hopefully you'll be uh, forgiven in the comments. 
It's a baby food and that. Was the biggest croissant in the universe. Oh, 